All right, looks like we are good and ready to go. I have to lower my mic again. G mic, no. <laughs> Speakers, Gert. Anyways, hey everyone, Larry from Ragnamuni here, welcoming you back to another episode of Let's Play Gran Turismo 2. Last time, we finished off first third of North City. And today, we're going to begin with the Lotus. You know, you know what time it is. It's time for everyone's favorite car of most wanted, the Elise. <clears throat> because apparently everyone thinks an Elise with Junkman parts is apparently the best car. Let me just change real quick, make sure that's all good. Turn that down just a hair more. That'll do nicely. Alrighty. It's been a, it's been a couple of days since I last uh, did this. At least we're on a nice, nice track. Hey, come on, let me pass you. Oh man, we got a race going over here. The way this is going, we definitely have a race going. I kind of like this. Oh yeah, we have a race. I hope I picked the correct Elise, I'll tell you that. Thankfully, Apricot Hill is not uh, that bad of a track. I don't mind it at all. Anyways, uh, in other gaming news that I've been playing on my off time, I actually finished off the the Ardoin, or as everyone knows it, Ardy, Hard Diary task, so I got that 10% thieving boost uh, in the game now. Like, permanently, and that's so beautiful. It just helps me so much in game. I've also did uh, Great Brain Robbery before the time of this recording, so that's just another quest down. And Dragon Slayer 2 requirements were out. And I'm kind of happy to see that all i got to do is gain a couple of smithing levels and do one quest that is pretty much just a walk around, and I'm done. I have everything I need to start that when that comes out. So I'm looking forward to it, unlike Monkey Madness 2. Curse you, Mod Ronin, for making that godforsaken terrible quest. Mod Ronin is my fall guy. But he doesn't work for Jagex any well, he still works for Jagex. Uh, but he doesn't work on old school anymore. Wow, those cars are getting stupidly close. Alright. That was a good turn. Um, but yeah, he doesn't work for uh, old school anymore. He's I think it is he I think he is now head of uh, social social marketing and video something something like that but it's kind of sad to see that it doesn't work on ultimate anymore but at the very least he's still very well employed at Jagex it's nice to see him kind of moving up in the world because social marketing just means he is now head of Twitter and I want to say if there's like an official YouTube channel he's probably the head of that too makes me wonder what they'll do to Mod Archie whenever they're finished with that uh, I've also adjusted the volume of the game because on the on the on quite a number of parts, I felt my like the car audio was just a tad bit too high. Unless I was talking it like ridiculously high. Oh god! Thanks for the push. I owe you. Okay, hang on, let me focus real quick. There we go, we won. Um, just the fact that... I can't even think now. Crate, I've lost my train of thought. I hate when that happens. That's a victory, though. That was a motorsport, at least. I'm thinking that's the one with a spoiler. Oh, we got one good track. I was actually longer than, it, than I was uh, hoping it would have been. Yeah. Yeah, so he's basically head of Twitter. Makes me wonder what the hell, what's gonna happen to Mod Archie if he'll, if he'll. Right, I have to. Uh, I gotta go get racing for this. No, I don't want the special. I could just cop out and buy like one of the racing Elises, but oh, that, that, that. 
let's get this paint scheme because it looks similar to the Lotus that we had before. Well, the initial paint scheme, anyways. And racing. Ooh, we got a good track, Tahiti. Nice and short. That's the way. That's the way it needs to be, if you ask me. It's the way it needs to be. I wonder if it's possible to actually race against one of those uh, motorsport Elise. Uh, the uh, you know the, the Elises that you can buy in the shop. I wonder if it's possible to race against one of them. Because if it is, you're pro oh. What was that? <laughs> what was that? <laughs> oh, that was so hilarious! I just, I just nip a wall, and it's like I take an instant 360 turn. God, Elise is suck. Whoa, grip, damn you! Oh my God, these guys can't take off road to save their life. At the, at the very least, though, we actually have a race here. Yes! Like, I can't do off-roading with the Elise to save my... Just, what is that? Oh my god. <laughs> Took me off surprise. I actually have to focus here. There we go. Decent turn there. Oh, be still my heart. And uh, before we're, we're uh, working on this, I actually am working on the more Tanya Heart Diaries so that I can get some Barrows stuff. Cause I gotta learn. I gotta learn to Barrows. If I learn to Barrows, I can do a lot of money making in the game. And I feel like as I've been progressing through RuneScape. There's a lot of good things to pass on to newer players. Now I'm not a RuneScape YouTuber or streamer. Never could be if I wanted to because my streaming speed is garbage, and I've only ever played one. I've only ever played two accounts: one on RS3, which was like the main game before a while later, and the uh, that same account just going through old school RuneScape, getting all that stuff done. A uh, guy answer asked me in the comments on one of the, on one of the past parts. Uh, it's like seriously RS3 or RS7, and I told him, and I will reiterate here for those that don't read comments. I play both. But I prefer 07. If only because it's a lot more simplistic. And they don't just hand out skill levels via microtransactions or uh, <coughs> easy scape methods, as they have been known to be called. And that's going to be an easy win here. That was a much better turn. But we're done with the Elise. Okay, so, barring the 360 I did... Wow, the 190 came in last in the, on the AI, so that just means I'm a better driver. Can we please get cars that have grip, please? Thanks. Like, actual grip, like that car that we had. The car was a nice car. I think there was another one. It wasn't, the t it wasn't like the 106. It was, it was something, I remember. Ooh. My coffee's coming back on me. That does it for the least. Time for the alarm. Look at that retro looking car. That looks that looks like something from the uh, 70s, 80s. Making good time at least. The Elan. New and old Elans only. Time for the racing. Uh, not racing, but uh, normal. Please be good track. Woo! Top speed alert. I like that. What the hell? I'm definitely tuning that past base because... There's a, there's a reason. All right, driver, start your engines. Yeehaw, let's play NASCAR. Man, this thing looks compact as hell. Look how small this car looks. I think this is the thinnest car in the game. Six speed. You are not a six speed. I should have tuned you a little bit better.
Thankfully, though, I do have more speed than the, uh, I was hoping this would have been way shorter if I had it tuned better. in USA I don't know song lyrics Cruise in USA This definitely looks like a Cruise in USA car. Does anyone remember that game? I think I only ever played the N64 version and it kicked my ass hard. Gonna be a surfing summer Surfing summer. Even though it's like the middle of October. Yeah, that was an easy race. Short, too. I like that. Watch Karma come back to bite me in the ass as they give me like Grand Valley or something. No, I swear. Okay, I swear to God, if I do get Grand Valley. And I don't mean East Section, I mean like Grand Valley. Oh, I'm gonna be. I'm, I am not gonna be a happy panda. I am not gonna be a happy panda. Ooh, we're almost done with Lotus. Ah, wrong one tune. How many days I've been playing this game for? Almost in a whole year. Hold on, where is it? There we go. Reverse Dalmatian. We are now the Reverse Dalmatian Alon. I swear if you give me Grand Valley, I'm gonna cry. Oh, thank, thank you, Based Gods. Thank you, Based Tahiti Road Gods. You have made my life easy. Reverse Dalmatian car coming through. Thankfully, though, the cars are. That's a nice looking Alon. You have, the, you have that uh, old stripe uh, look to it. See, though, this definitely looks like how you would play uh, a gr kind of like a Gran Turismo track. Like, look how old this car is, but it's still going pretty fast. This definitely, I think this definitely screams more cruising USA. Decent grip, I'll give it that. The brakes are kind of bad, though. So it's a decent controlling car. Better than the Elise. I mean, this thing at least has grip. As I sit here and record this, I am also trying to think of what the next game I want to play for the channel is. Because like I said, my library is rather limited to like whatever I can emulate or Steam library. And at the same time, some games I feel I wouldn't be able to play nearly as well. Uh, not so much. Like, I suck at them. More accurately, like, they would never be in the good quality that they could be. Like, this is fine. Everyone's agreed on that. But maybe I want to play something like Freedom Planet or uh, even Sonic Mania and just think of how bad the quality would be if I were to record the way I usually record. I mean, I could probably do the whole 30 FPS thing, but at the same time, uh... Yeah, this race is going by stupidly fast. This will be a nice short part. Nice and short part. That's the way we like it. Well, I want to try to condense. I, I feel like if I tried to condense down and do more 15-minute runs, it'd definitely save me a load in uploading to uh, the likes of YouTube and such, just because it'll be easier to manage.
Pardon me if you see something on screen. I need to I need to look at my list here. Come on. Let me see my list of events to pull off. So that that Tuscan Tigra, Audi, Golf Beetle. I have like seven left to go. Good lord. Yeah, I've still got I've still got a while. I've still got a while. Uh, let me see what the next event is. I believe it's TVR. Yeah, we're getting there. Oh, do I really want to do it though? I mean, for this particular session, because I could just keep recording and make it, you know, short and sweet. I believe Opel is next, and then it's a Tigra. You know what? I'm going to cut it off here, and next time we pick it back up, we're going to do TVR and Opel. So until then, this is Ragnamune signing out. You guys have a great night. Thanks for watching. Take care and drive safe and all that other stuff. Bye. And safe state. Forgot about that, too. Bye.